Greetings AMC Sears, I'm John Campia. This Friday, October the 7th, the brand new film Real Steel opens in AMC theaters everywhere. Recently, I had a chance to sit down and talk with the star of the film, the one and the only Hugh Jackman. Check it out. Uh, Hugh, when we talked in Las Vegas, you told me that the, one of the great things about this movie was it's not just an action movie, it's not just a sci-fi movie, it's a movie with heart, it's a movie with a human story. I've got to admit, at the time, I didn't really buy it because I'm thinking, that's what they all say, <laughs> yeah. really sad. But it does. It, yeah. This is a movie with heart, and it is yeah. a movie with a great human story. How yeah. do you think you guys, between you and Sean and, and all the, the team, were able to elevate that human story and, and keep this movie with all of its heart? It had. It was on the road there in the script I read. It was one of those movies where I was like, okay, I get this. I see where they're going with it. But not until I spoke to Sean, and Sean gave me his draft, it just went from here to here. Mm. Like, Sean came out with some of the best lines in the movie. Like, he wrote, like, you know, and I say to the kid, uh, I, I don't understand, I'm doing everything I can, what do you want from me, you know? And right. he says, I want you to fight for me, that's all I've ever wanted. You know, it's a great line, you know, boxing movie, and that's Sean, because Sean, as a writer, director, he wears his heart on his sleeve, and he's not afraid of it. Now, one of the really great, pleasant surprises in this movie was Dakota. Yes. Uh, he, he, he was right. fantastic. What was he like to work with? Dakota is, like, he, it's so obvious he's going to be a star, right? You know, it's so, but I don't want him to hear that, you know, in a way, because one of his greatest qualities is, A, he's a natural. Acting is just so natural for him. B, he's just got... A maturity without being precocious. He doesn't seem at all like like a normal Hollywood kid. He's just a great actor. He's a very polite boy. The hard thing for him, and probably for me as well, was being really mean to each other. Like, you know, <laughs> I have such affection for him. I really loved hanging with him. And um, Sean had to keep needling us. He's like, guys, seriously, you meant to be. Let's go for it. You know. And after several takes, I remember Dakota looking over at his mum like, uh oh, I'm getting in trouble. I don't think I'm... <laughs> it's all right. Sean told me to say that. You know. So, like, one of the really interesting things about this was that you're looking at virtual characters in a ring in, in many ways, but the way the film cuts between you, the ring, that energy, it, you know, as an audience member, you feel like you're watching a rock, you're on the edge of your seat, you're excited. How are you able to maintain that kind of energy yeah. when, in many ways, you're just dealing with there? Because i got to imagine it's different than other, like, green screen environments. There's no green screen in this movie. Right. So what was amazing for me was Sean had shot all the fights the, with the robots and could show us what the fight was going to look like mm -hmm. um, so we could memorize it. Sometimes we'd have the guys in the ring fighting it out for us, you know, uh, on stilts, doing the whole thing, you know. And the big difference for me, though, was Sugar Ray Leonard. Right. Sugar Ray kept talking to me like... It, I was a little slow. It took me a while for it to sink in. But he goes, Hugh, the most important thing for you, man, is you're the corner man. This look from you to that, he says, you have to carry all the emotion to give that fighter strength. You have to take the audience through your eyes, and same for Dakota, through your eyes, they're gonna believe in that robot. You know the special effects are gonna be amazing. And I, I really was like, wow. He said, like Angelo Dundee for him was the difference between winning and losing some bouts. Mm. So it was, that was really a great, great kind of wake up call that he gave me. I'd, I would look, I'd be shooting those scenes, and I'd look over Ray, and he'd be like, <laughs> you know. Listen, Hugh, honestly, I had so much fun watching this movie. Congratulations. Thank you. We can't wait to have it on AMC screens. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. Real Steel opens in AMC theaters everywhere Friday, October the 7th, but there's no need to wait. Follow the links in this post to buy your tickets online right now. I'm John Campia for AMC Theaters, where movies live.